Let's take 1 fourth and divide that by 7. So when we do that, 1 fourth, that's a fraction. It's less than 1. And we're trying to see how many times 7 goes into this number that's less than 1. So we should end up with a pretty small number, certainly less than 1. So keep that in mind. For the 7, what I like to do is call this 7 over 1. It's still 7, it's just 7 divided by 1. It equals 7, but things line up now. What we'll do is we're going to take the reciprocal of 7 over 1, or 7. So let's move the 7 down and the 1 up. Because when we do that, now we can say 1 fourth. Instead of division, we can multiply by that reciprocal of 7 over 1, or 7. So 1 goes up top, 7 goes on the bottom. That's 1 seventh, and we're just going to multiply. 1 times 1, that's 1, and then 4 times 7 is 28. So 1 fourth divided by 7, or 1 fourth times 1 seventh, that equals 1 28th. And like we said, this is a pretty small number, which is what we'd expect. This is Dr. V. Thanks for watching.